hey guys welcome back to my channel this is your girl sandy if you're new here welcome 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 if you're returning sorry you don't know how your girl feel about you yeah yeah so please don't forget to like share and subscribe don't forget also to put your notification bell on if you're not a member of a subscribe just smash the button hit the button do something but just make sure you don't leave and you don't subscribe because your girl have a lot in store and many many more to come so in today's video guys i will be doing my front porch as i said before i uploaded a video a couple days ago with how i installed the fan for this area so this is pretty much a continuation of how i'm going to be designing this area on my porch so guys this rug that i'm putting down i got it from ross i think i got a great deal on the amount i paid for it as well i've been to other stores and these pretty much cost way more i think the rug is a little bit oversized for the porch but i'm going to do a little tuck air in there to make sure that it fits the space the color is what i was really looking for for this design so with that said i don't think i'm gonna really take it back i'm gonna keep it but you as you as the video go along guys you will see how i took this to make it look so neat as well and it's not really um visible to the eyes that i pretty much did that So what I'm basically doing is trying to make the rug as neat as possible so that when I put the chairs down on it, it won't really be, you know, not leveled. I'm trying to make it as level as I can so that it will work great for the space. So the chairs I'm going to be using as well. I got those from Ross. I got those on a sale those i got them i think that they were selling for like 90 dollars a piece and i got them for 50 i think 50 dollars 55 dollars somewhere there about so i picked those two chairs up from ross and the table that i'll be using later on as well that i'm going to be placing on the um in the space that i picked up at ross as well i don't remember if i did the table in it all but i got the table for 60 dollars at ross they all work so perfectly together so in total i think i paid like a hundred and 70 dollars for everything i don't think it was a bad price it pretty much gave me the look that i was going for without me having what i really want to put on the porch to be honest is one of those sofa kind of look that's what i'm really going for but i'm going to be waiting until you know a lot of these items go on sale later on in the year before i purchase it because a lot of these things the price just went up because of the time of year i am also trying to use the drapes that i used last year i washed them i didn't iron them <laughs> and i'm not gonna iron them because the breeze will work wonders it will flag all those creases out of those drapes so i picked those up those window panels up at amazon last year and i did do a design for fall on my porch which i'm going to also leave that video in the description box for you guys to check it out as well in that video i did a little painting i also that's when i pretty much did most of the design on the porch you guys you see my beautiful fan so that fan was gifted to me 
from Yaita Homes. I really, really appreciate it. It's working out so well for the space. Later on in the video, I am going to demonstrate how it lights up and all of that. So what I'm pretty much doing is hanging all the drapes. I hang the drapes all around the porch and it is giving me everything that i wanted to be honest and as i said before i will be leaving a link in the description box for you guys to check out the video that i did last year when i was installing all those window panels and also the rods and everything because i did do a video when i was putting all of those things up so guys please enjoy and as i said before i will be in and out of the video to let you guys know where i got certain things from So these pillows, guys, I did pick these up at Ross. I also did them in a all. I will also leave that all in the description box as well because a lot of the stuff that I'm currently using in the space, I also showed you guys in that all. So I will also let, leave that in the description box as well. So here you have it where I'm putting up these nice flower holders, the onion ones. I got those from... I think I got those from Marshalls and those were on sale as well. So I'm using some floral picks that I picked up at the at home store. They have like the white, the greens and the yellow in it, in it. That's the look pretty much that I'm going for. I'm really trying to get like a tropical jungle feel from the design that i'm trying to create here so that's pretty much what i'm going for so as the video progress you will see all this come together with the greens and the little yellow and gold and all these neutral colors that i'm trying to incorporate in the space i'm really really going for like a nice natural look so what i'm going to be doing now guys i picked up these flowers trees from I think I got these from Walmart. I did pick up two from Sam's Club on my way to the cashier, <laughs> to the register to check out. I met this guy and he told me that, um, cause I think that these were selling at Sam's Club for like $25. And he told me that Walmart had them for, I think $12 or something like that. So Walmart is pretty much right beside my sam's club so i just put them right on down and went all the way over to walmart and picked them up and they are not disappointing at all so i did pick up a bag of fertilizer we call it fertilizer back home that's what we call it like um dirt for the flow um for the trees or flowers or whatever you're going to be doing and um i put them in those containers that i picked up at ross as well so here i am transferring them and also i'm going to be placing them on the porch as well so keep watching guys
So I'm also bringing in these two side tables. They are, um, I used them last year on the porch as well. I used them in the design that I created last year fall. So I'm kind of bringing them back into the space just to make them work if we're having coffee or anything like that on the area we can pretty much use it as a side table so that's what i'm pretty much doing bringing them back so that we can use them one is a place on each side and i will be doing a light design on them because i kind of have a lot going on so i'm hanging this green reef on my door so that's as i said before that's kind of what i'm going for the nice natural forest um greenery island feel like kind of making the porch kind of look like what's going on in my backyard but not so much of a jungle vibe jungle vibe but not so deep jungle like what's going on my, on my back porch so pretty much that's what i'm doing so i will be laying this black mat on the floor right in front of the door i picked that up at casco last year as well if you guys know or see what's going on here, you can see that your girl really take care of her stuff because this is the same mat that I used last year. And all I'm doing is sweeping it off. So this kind of jungle mat that says welcome, I picked this up at Ross. Also did it in that all. So I will place that link in the video as well, as I said before. So that's pretty much what I'm going for. So yes, guys. Your girl is doing our thing on this beautiful porch. So these two pillars, are these pillars? Guys, I don't even know what these are called. But I saw them and I liked them and I thought that my daughter, I think that there are some cushions or whatever. So I thought that my daughter would love to sit on these while we're outside or if we have, you know, other kids coming over to hang out, these cushions will be so, so nice for them to sit on. I myself even went down and lay on the floor and put my head down on it. So, and they are so comfortable. So they are working so great in the space. I'm also bringing in these two greenery that I have, there are some fake plants that I have in these beautiful gold vase. So that's pretty much what I'm bringing in. I'm also bringing in this dark wicker um, tray that I'll be using in the space as well. So you guys can see I'm using the blacks, I'm using the grays, I'm using the whites, I'm using the greenery. You guys pretty much see what I'm going for on this window panel, guys. I am putting a, um, I think these are some tie backs, some of the smaller tie backs, decorative ones that I got from Ross. So I will be using two of those outside as well. So I just want to say big up to all of my Friday Night Live ladies. They told me that I should actually use this product on my pillows to protect them. So uh, your girl went to the Home Depot. Your girl pick up one and your girl spray it on all my cushions and my pillows. So yes, thank you ladies. Thank you. Big up on yourself. Yes. <laughs> So here is the finished look, guys. I am so excited. 
and i hope you all enjoy the rest of the video please like share subscribe also put your notification bell on and as your girl said before just smash that subscribe button you know smash the subscribe button and thank you all for your love and your support and your encouragement and all those emails and text messages i've been getting i appreciate you guys so much and i hope you guys enjoy this beautiful video so until next time guys bye i love you all and god bless you all thank you